A summertime staple in the Chippewa Valley will soon look a little different. Evan Denton spoke with Chippewa Falls Parks official to see what upgrades are coming to the Urban Park Zoo. Hyenas, tigers, bears, oh my, three of the Urban Park Zoo's exhibits will undergo a facelift soon. Within each exhibit, there's different um, damages that we've noticed, things that need to be addressed. So with the hyenas, tigers, it's a lot of the interior faux rocks that we have. There's been some cracks uh, in that. Tigers, I know it's more of a damage that's been caused by uh, some of the heavy uh, recreational equipment that's in there for them. They slam it against the wall and it breaks. Bears, a lot of the same things. There's some leaks um, since we have some water fixtures in there. And so we want to make sure that those get addressed. Jimenez estimates the cost for the repairs is a little more than $80,000. One major change would be more shaded areas for the animals try to test it out in the tiger exhibit to see how it would work. You know, try to give it more of a natural feel as opposed to putting some sort of canvas tarp or something like that. And if it works well with the tigers, then we can look at expanding that to the bears because the bears is pretty wide open. They don't get a lot of shade in that area. And so being able to provide more natural shading opportunities for them would be good for the bears. Jimenez is confident the public will be pleased with the changes. As people come to enjoy the, the ability to come see animals that they don't get to see every day. The work that we want to do here, it's really all about providing the animals with a better atmosphere and containment for them. The goal is to make the exhibits look and presentable for the community and make it more lively for the animals. Jimenez says that the zoo is still coming up with ways to raise the $80,000. In Chippewa Falls, Evan Denton, News 18. Jimenez says there's not an exact target date for the restoration project to begin, but he's hopeful the repairs will be addressed next year.